Hello and welcome to Dino's Vault and today I present the world's most beautiful motorcycle. Here it is, the Harley Davidson Sportster S. We have the MV Agustas, we have the Ducatis, but when you look at the Sportster S from Harley Davidson, I mean it looks picture perfect. It looks as if Gal Gadot meets the madness, I mean the beauty of Gal Gadot meeting the insanity of Harley Quinn. It's like, I mean, Linkin Park collaborating with Celine Dion. It's like Enrique Iglesias allowing Eminem to do a rap through his lyrics. The beauty meets the beast. The melody meets the madness. I mean, there's nothing like it when you look at it, especially in white. I mean, this blue color looks absolutely stunning. Yeah, special thanks to my friend Rishi, who has allowed me to feature this bike for you guys. But right from the word go, when I first set my eyes on it, man, I fell in love. I mean, there's nothing like it. It's, uh, it's, it's like when you ride this bike, I actually expressed this during my motor vlog as well. You feel as if you've been... You're a cannonball being shot out of a cannon. That's the kind of torque it has on offer. So the start of the show, of, however, is the 1250cc Revolution Max engine. Now look at the beautiful engine casing that they have come up with, the 60 degree V-twin. And uh, this is the same engine that they introduced with their Pan Am or the Pan America adventure touring bike, uh, a different direction that Harley Davidson choose uh, to take and to shy away from formality and stuff but uh, boy oh boy this thing is unlike anything I have ever seen or witnessed before I'm sure that will be the case with you when you cast your eyes on this bike in flesh for the first time now giving you the run through the specs uh, you can see the fattest front tire ever I mean uh, what is the dimension of your uh, rear tire on your Duke 390 maybe it is 150 section or most of the sport bikes in the 400cc class offer 150 section rear tire but the front tire here itself offers 160 section this is a 160 section uh, Dunlop uh, GT503 you can see it is 160 by 70 17 inch wheel up front so that's massive it gives you that boulevard badass boulevard bruiser kind of a feel uh, the <laughs> the beast or the hulk among the motorcycles look at the rear wheel it's 180 section completely exposed and it's a solo ridden bike now when you make a bike passionately i mean just for the passion for riding or passion for motorcycles you usually do away with the pillion seat i mean the it's all about you know taking this bike out early morning you know experiencing the glorious sunrise feeling the sun kissing your face experiencing the wind hitting your chest and breathing fresh air into your soul transforming you into a completely new person I mean forget all those uh, hate forget all those abuses forget all those insults when you write this you feel like forgiving the world and start over starting all over again and fixing your eyes on the road ahead rather than looking back on all those scars uh, I mean it, you allow nature to work on your scars and help you become a better person but anyway now talking about the rest of the uh, this thing the powertrain itself 121 uh, BHP 125 Newton meters six speed gearbox and uh, a teardrop shaped tank uh, it is 11.8 liters almost 12 liters uh, but the fuel efficiency figure is something that will baffle your mind 19.6 kmpl for 1250cc sports cruiser goodness gracious a friend of mine <laughs> owns a, a second gen r3 i mean that gives him when he i mean he rides pretty aggressively he gets around 15 16 which is really really bad but my r3 used to give me at least 25 kmpl but still for a bike of this class this capacity getting 19.6 kmpl is phenomenal and it is close to that because uh, i've been riding this for the last couple of days we did a full tank day before yesterday and we've been riding till now and still we have two points of fuel left so that's phenomenal fuel efficiency i don't know how they managed to do that and uh, apart from that you have the belt drive uh, system the signature uh, element of uh, all the harleys and the way the stickering is done again highlights the uh, the beauty factor 
the bar and mirrors are flawlessly laid you get adjustable levers for the clutch as well as the brake you have a brembo master cylinder you have brembo brakes front and rear you get uh, usd forks that are fully adjustable i mean uh, that's as good as it can get for a bike of this price point also when you sit on this bike you feel like batman <laughs> so if only this uh, came in black i'm sure batman would have this in his bat cave for sure that's how it feels you just need a cape that is going to go <laughs> go flying at the ring of the throttle i mean in black this is going to look like absolute menace absolute beast uh, so for me this undeniably is one of the most special moments uh, that i'm featuring the sportster s here uh, at dino's world and thanks to my biker brother rishi but anyway coming back to the speedo console this is another piece of art just four inch full color tft console has all the relevant uh, info and the controls and where is the key my dear friend because the key is actually this little key fob over here so you just carry this and you have wireless or keyless uh kind of start and operation so all you need to do is turn on the ignition and the animation comes up beautifully you have a harley davidson uh, this thing and the dark custom theme running through the motorcycle is uh, absolute uh, bliss and here you have the riding modes this is already set to sport then you have rain you have uh, road and sport sport is like unleashing all the mayhem and then you also have different uh, layouts here between uh, navigation and music and the motorcycle here you have the tire pressure monitoring uh, system the engine coolant temperature the uh, battery voltage and uh, here you getting into the settings you have general settings where you can adjust clock and time and everything that you can think of then ride customization and ride mode has uh, all the details here with the custom a and custom b being available as well so apart from that you also have appearance to increase or decrease brightness bluetooth connectivity phone notifications and what not so let's go back to the home and here you can show them you have dedicated controls to play pause and uh, you know forward and reverse uh, uh, music you have dedicated buttons for volume control so that's all well thought out you have a, a dedicated hazard lights button and of course dedicated mode button cruise control right over here and heated grips as well so everything gets dedicated tactile buttons so that is what is the beauty of this machine everything is simple and easy to operate the price is around 15.54 lakhs post the price reduction uh, is what i feel and you can get in touch with your nearest harley davidson uh, showroom to get the exact on road price and when uh, you can get delivery of this beautiful beast so what do you guys think Don't you think it is one of the most beautiful uh, bikes currently available in our market that you can park in your living room? I definitely feel that is the case and if I were to own one I'm sure it will be in my living room. But anyway, uh now how does it feel to ride? Now that 125 Newton meters of torque, 121 bhp when they are matched together, what you get is absolute riding pleasure. So how do I uh enjoy that on the road? You're going to find out in this ride motor vlog let's see the road now so this my friend is the most beautiful motorcycle on the face of this planet period i mean the 1250 revolution max engine and the design silhouette is so flawless that you can park it in your living room i mean what a bike man what a flawless design and it comes with a you know keyless start system we just need to carry the fob so the 4 inch full color tft is absolutely gorgeous has different riding modes road rain and uh, sport so let's actually put it to sport it puts out 121 bhp and 125 newton meters of max torque This is a torque monster. A 160 section front tire. When was the last time you saw that?
scars. The world of scars that hits you. <laughs> it's gonna rip you off the seat. That's the kind of rush that you feel. Okay. Off we go. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I still have... Oh... What a morning! What a rush! What a machine! I mean, look at the seating posture! And dare I say, it reminds me of the Indian Scout but doesn't match the kind of performance this bike has on offer it's phenomenal man it's absolutely crazy it's a mad machine i mean just how beautiful it's like harley quinn's madness meeting the beauty of gal gadot the beauty and sheer power of gal gadot that's how wonderfully made this thing is it's flawless it's just flawless beyond imagination ah words won't suffice to you know admire the sheer beauty and the engineering brilliance that defines the sports to rest from harley davidson ah ha ha what a lovely feeling what a lovely way to start this day when you have a machine like this to play around with Oh ho! Oh. <laughs> I feel happy. <laughs> I feel happy, genuinely happy, because this is a freaking monster. The brakes are brilliant. That us never did I ever feel so confident pushing a. Uh, Harley Davidson to its very limits. I mean, this thing is a piece of art. This thing is a piece of history, a gem. I mean, the most precious gem that you cannot do without in the history of motorcycling for the love of motorcycles. that sound the suspension is bang on point <sighs> but the chassis it holds it sticks I mean what kind of <laughs> a magic wizardry is this it's unimaginable incomprehensible indescribable but it's absolutely you know totally lovable right from anything and everything about this motorcycle is pure love thanks for watching i just hope you enjoyed riding along this new age beast from harley davidson that is so good that any price for this would feel as the perfect match see you guys next time around thanks for watching